In this video, we will be enabling Firebase Authentication. Select Authentication in bold and click on Get Started. So here, you can see, we have multiple sign-in options. We will be using email and password, phone login, anonymous login and one of the remaining available options. In Templates tab, you can see various templates for different login methods. We will discuss about these in detail later. Under Usage tab, you can see details about active users. Once a user has created an account, his or her details will appear under Users tab. So we will start with email and password. That, we will do in the next video. Now go back to Android Studio. Open Build.Gradle Module App. Under Dependencies, add Firebase Auth. There is no need to specify the version number here. Here, Firebase Auth. MOS MOS equals Firebase Auth get instance. So Firebase Auth is the entry point to Firebase authentication. If we want to create a user, get current user or update password or such sort of things, we need to do it through Firebase Auth. Now, we will get current user. Since we have not created any user, it should be now. If mauth.getCurrentUser equals now, we will display no user found through toast. Toast. Make text. Get application context. No user found. Length long. Dot show. Now we will run this code. You can see here, no user found. We will create user through email and password in next video.